Jessica Rowe. Jessica Rowe. Jessica Rowe is a journalist, author and self-declared crap housewife. She first met entertainer Denise Drysdale on the set of Morning Show Studio 10, where they became instant best friends. You've got pink hair. Especially for Jess. Since then, the pair have launched a podcast. And what am I? Pod? She's in a car. And they support each other through thick and thin. This is It Takes Two. How would I describe Jess? She is the most wonderful human being. I feel like you're a, an angel on earth oh, spreading love. And a bit of mess. Oh, mess, yeah. She, ha <laughs> she, she hasn't got the clean gene or the cooking gene. You open the fridge, you go, oh no, this fridge is terrible. You clean my fridge, you wipe it all out, you make it all neat and tidy, you put things in Tupperwares, you find the lids. I mean, it's very hard to make friends when you get older because you get set in your ways. So to having Jess in my life is just wonderful. Aww. Absolutely wonderful. Right back at you. And she's not a hugger, but I like to give you hugs. <laughs> I reckon I'm the only person. That, that I you... let. Yes. Yeah. Do you think it's from living in the country for so long on my own? I just think you're not a hugger. Also, what I adore about you is that you're my partner in silliness. I know. You bring oh. out my even sillier side and we love each other. We're very different. But... Oh, chalk and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> but but it works. Yeah, and it it's, it's a really... Your friendship brings such joy to my life. I can't imagine my life without you in it. I've decided to leave Studio 10. It's been a very hard thing for me to do, but it's because my family need me. Jess, you resigned from Studio 10 last year to spend more time with your family. How's life going now? Life is wonderful. I'm the happiest I've ever been. I think I'm almost 49, and what is so wonderful is I feel lighter. I, like so many people, I think you feel torn in so many different directions. You want to be fabulous at your career, the best mum, the best wife, the best partner, the best friend, and you can't do it all at once. And for me to have been able to take a step back from my career and lean in for my girls, lean in for my husband, is just the best. No job's worth it if you're, if no. you're suffering head problems that, with it. Well, it's not it. worth it. Leave it there when you go home. And I know for my mental health, it's been such a good thing to take a bit of a step back. Yeah. Anisi was very much there for me when I was struggling at work and wondering what to do and where to go. And, you know, we shared a dressing room and we used to talk a lot. Yeah. And I remember you'd give me hugs and give me pep talks and <laughs> swear sometimes because I'm not a swearer, but you swear. Yes, and, I'm a but, good swearer. Yeah. How would your life be different if you hadn't met Jess? I would have been lonely. I really mean that because um, I've spent a hell of a lot of time on my own, uh, working, living, whatever, always away. Now to have Jess and even just with the, doing the podcast and the shows, because we're going to continue doing shows, I know she's thinking of me even though if she doesn't ring. So just to have that when you're later in life, it's terrific. It's wonderful. Only last year because I'm... I'm Oh, well, I you tell him about yes. everything. Yeah, I on. had a detached retina. <laughs> I had a knee replacement. Then I got blood clots in the thing. But um, Jess came up a couple of times to look after me and she was so attentive and it was really lovely to have. For friends, it's about showing up and, and turning up when people need you because it's very easy to do that when everything's great and fantastic. But it's also about showing up when someone is going through a really yeah. hard time and, and loving them and caring and just and just being there. Mm. Come what may. Yeah. Hi, I'm Lee Sales. Thanks for watching this story. If you'd like to watch more of 730's stories, they are on the left of your screen. And tap on the button below to subscribe and get the latest from ABC News.